Hi folks! Hi folks, this is my boyfriend, you're finally meeting him. Welcome to my channel, today we're taking you on a nice trip. We're going out for the weekend, we're gonna spend the night in Bergamo, go to a spa uh, called San Pellegrino, and then tomorrow we're gonna move to Chiavenna, which is a town close to the border with Switzerland, and we have really nice views there, waterfalls, you can uh, swim in the river or like in the pond of water, I don't know how it's called, and yeah, hope you enjoy it. Terza volta che giriamo. Alright folks, so we just finished to have lunch, now we're heading to the spa. Uh, we got uh, two menus, like the daily menu, and it was like two focaccia with... Uh, how do you say focaccia in English? Focaccia. Focaccia, which is like um, kind of sandwich but nicer. Uh, stuff with hams and like sauces and a lot of different things. Uh, they were very very tasty. And then we got... he got an orange squeeze, I got a quarter of a liter of wine, white wine. Then he got a coffee and I got a limoncello and in total we spent uh, 13 euros 50 so around 15 pounds it's really nothing really really nice yeah. place 11 pounds Cost okay 11 pounds Cost less instead ah, yeah yeah 11 <laughs> pounds sorry and yeah it was a very nice place and we're thinking about coming back here for dinner after the spa because there's quite a bit of choice uh, and I don't know it's just chill cheap good food so I recommend it, it's called Bar Il Sogno. Uh, I will leave you the name right here. And now we're heading to the spa. We're in a rush, so... Yeah, we're quite in a rush because it took us too long to eat. Some really nice roundabouts over here. So... We actually get like a nice view even on the walk from the parking lot to the um, to the actual spa. And I'll just show you around a little bit. So guys, so we are just entering the changing rooms now and we enter with some coupons that we got as a gift uh, last year but the price is uh, 64 euros each uh, and it's like for the full day in the spa and for an aperitivo, so like a live dinner let's say uh, at 6 p.m. So that's it. Hello folks, we're at QT Terme, San Pellegrino. Very beautiful, a lot of nice jacuzzis, pools, outdoor pools, uh, different types of rooms. The saunas are closed. Yeah, saunas and steam rooms are closed for the COVID situation. But like apart from that, there's not much change, honestly. Like in closed areas, you have to walk around with the mask on. But like uh, outside or like uh, when you're in the pool or like sitting down, you don't need to. So it's very good for that. And now we're in the external garden and we took these teas that are for free and you can get them around the place there's actually like quite a bit of free things like apart from the aperitivo that i was mentioning earlier uh, there's also these teas and there also, there's also like body lotions and face creams that you can put on and like of course if you want them like if you want to bring them on uh, they sell them um, as well but yeah there's some places where you can just access the creams and just relax with the creams it's very nice and yeah, now we're just chilling before the aperitivo. Thank <laughs> you. 
my boyfriend is making me come to this place which is illegal too in fact we cannot access because we're not supposed to be here are we we made a mistake i pressed the wrong button on the elevator and we're going back down yeah sure <laughs> So we wanted to take the funicular to go to the upper city but uh, it's suspended on the weekends probably due to the COVID situation so we just got the tickets and we're taking the bus. You can actually go on top even by foot but it's quite steep uh, and we're tired from the spa and from the swimming so I think we'll just take the bus. So folks we just left the candy shop, this Ciccio, Ciccio in Italian means fat, uh, got a lot of candies for himself. Oh, anche questo. Yeah. <laughs> okay. And we got, we got some different things, but like the restaurant is gonna uh, be available in 10 minutes, so we're gonna head back there. Are we gonna do a video with this caramel? I don't know, just trying it. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Ci farà assaggiare? Sì. Sì, no, la 
Are you from Tennessee? Because you're the only tan I see. Ooh, I'm show. I put you in shade, go up and up. Ciao. You cheat your kid. Hey, folks. Bam. We're freezing. It's quite cold. Very cold. By the way folks, uh, we didn't have time before to um, uh, show you around the apartment because uh, it was uh, late and we had to go to the restaurant and I just wanted to talk to you about the fact that at QC Terme, QC Terme um, in the packet that they gave us inside of our lockers we found some face masks uh, that were very nice that you can use on your eyes as well so it's not so bad and it was all included in the price together with the robe and um, flip-flops that we had to return later though and it was a very nice experience I didn't get to show you around the whole thermal place but I think it's uh, better for you like to actually go there and discover it yourself because it's just nicer than just seeing everything on a video at the restaurant uh, we got two main, um, a starter shared and a bottle of wine, he got the dessert and the coffee and in total we spent 56 euros, I think that for the place that we were, for the quality of the food it was actually quite fair, um, apart from the coffee, because 1 euro 40 for a coffee, for an espresso, it's way too much. Tomorrow we're gonna move to Chiavenna, which is uh, northern than Bergamo, it's still in Lombardy and uh, uh, it's very close to the border with Switzerland. We're not uh, sure if we'll go to the waterfalls that are very close there or if we'll go to a lake close to Chiavenna, but anyway, it's gonna be very nice. If you wanna see uh, us swimming or like exploring these natural um, landscapes, sorry, there's a mosquito, these natural landscapes, uh, um, Tune in on the next vlog that I'll upload very soon. So, there's a lot of noises, I'm very distracted. Ah, oh, yeah, one thing about the Airbnb. I find it nice and very peculiar because of all the statues that you found around the stairs, but at night it's way too creepy. But maybe in a nice way, I'm not so sure, but it's very creepy. Anyway, thank you, folks, and I'll see you in the next vlog. Bye, Bye folks! folks.